On the lot occupied by Case IH, there was a lot of iron out there, including this big boy. We talked with Tom Dean, product manager for high horsepower tractors at Case IH. He gave us a tour of this tractor on display. We're having a lot of fun out here. It's the most horsepower on the lot out here at Farm Progress Show, and it's the new Case IH Steiger 600 tractor. We have it in both wheel version and quad track version, but the quad track is always what steals the show for us. It gets all the attention. And today we're selling about 60 to 70 percent of our Steigers on quad track. But the big news for us is really the, the horsepower on the tractor. So, 600. Yes, and really what's driving the, the 600 horsepower, it actually grows to 660 peak horsepower. When you get in tough conditions, that power rises for you. But what's driving it is these producers are getting larger and larger and they're looking for bigger and bigger implements. They want to get more acres done in a day. It's harder and harder to find good hired operators. And so implements like this 26 foot 870 that we have here, and it's a 13 shank tool that really wants all of that 660 peak horsepower. And the producers love it because they're just getting a lot more done in a day's time. As I look back over your shoulder there, I mean, there's a very obvious styling change to begin with. There's a big styling change. We have we have a Case IH FBT 12.9 liter engine in this tractor. It has a two-stage turbocharger. It gives us some phenomenal boost in this in this engine. And the hood change is also now a rear opening hood, where previously it, it opened up there toward the cab. So it's a nice, easy open hood. But it also is the evolution of our Case IH styling as well. Ease of servicing for the producer? Absolutely. And that's one of the nice things about that, that front, front opening hood. We've got all the service at ground level as we usually do. The other great thing that they'll like in this new tractor is a lot of operator comfort enhancements in the cab. I was just going to say, it looks like a spacious cab, uh, great visibility all around. It is. It's an industry-leading cab size. These producers are spending more and more hours in the day, up to you know 18 hours a day in, in, in hectic planting times. It's a, it's a huge mobile office for them. We've got a brand new multi-control armrest in there that we brought a whole group of producers into our engineering headquarters in Burr Ridge and, and had them design it for us. So it's been very, very, very well accepted, and we also added cab suspension to this tractor so that they're isolated from all those shocks in the field. And this new Case IH tractor has a new fluid reservoir on it to help accomplish better fuel efficiency in this new cleaner air era. It's called the DEF tank, D-E-F, the diesel exhaust fluid reservoir. It's there, as Leo Bose explained to us, to help accomplish the selective catalytic reduction on this tractor. He explains. For over 100 horsepower tractors, we'll use the selective catalytic reduction, SCR technology. So what that allows us to do is tune that engine so we reduce the particulate matter. So we've got to look at that nitrogen oxide content. So what we use is a second fluid called diesel exhaust fluid. That diesel exhaust fluid is a urea base. It's about 32.5% urea. And we inject that into the exhaust stream after the combustion process. So what that allows us to do is meet compliance, but it really gives us fuel savings. So when you look at the quad track that's behind me, the high fuel rates that they're using for every gallon of diesel exhaust fluid that we use, we'll save that producer two gallons of diesel fuel. So the producer will add some of the DEF fluid, if you will, as he or she fuels up. Yep, and when you look at fueling, we, we tried to size the tank or the size of the vehicle. So that means about twice that I fill the fuel tank, then I would feel, feel, uh, fill the diesel exhaust fluid. About what will the DEF cost? Any idea? Well, ballpark figure. The, the DEF, that uh, diesel exhaust fluid that we see today, is about the same price as diesel fuel. So, depending upon bulk, and we'll supply it through a Case IH dealer network, so a two and a half gallon carry tote, all the way up to the bulk fill, 330 gallons. So, the price is about in line with diesel fuel. Now, these. Uh standards continue to advance over the next few years, right? Advance and, and more stringent standards. So by 2014, leading indus industry engineers will tell us that SCR technology will have to be used. And you're already seeing it in the over-the-road truck market from the standpoint of when you take a look at semi-trucks. Uh, they're using SCR technology as well as uh, the heavy-duty pickup trucks. Uh, say a Dodge chassis cab 4500 series is using SCR technology today moving forward. That's probably what's going to have to be used. 
Thanks to Leo Bose there for the great explanation of the DEF for the SCR on the Case IH. You can get more information on the Case IH tractors by going to their website, caseih.com.